Hi everyone, my name is Ray Prakash and in this video we will be seeing the fastest possible way to calculate a cube root of any number. It's an amazing shortcut guys and I will be showing you how do you use that shortcut in actual aptitude questions. Okay, that's also very important. You learn a speed math technique and you need to apply that in the actual questions also. Okay, so both things will be seeing here. Okay. So to find that amazing shortcut, I need to go through differentiation. Okay, so differentiation is not important here or it is actually those who doesn't know, just leave it. I, I'll just prove that result to arrive at that final result actually. And you need to remember that final result. Okay, so let's say for example, I want to calculate the cube root of let's say x here. Okay, so I want to calculate cube root of x. So y is equal to some x cube root. So I'll, I will write this y is equal to x raised to 1 by 3 okay now once you write y equal to x raised to 1 by 3 now differentiate it again those who doesn't doesn't know leave it just wait for the final result so dy by dx is equal to 1 by 3 x raised to minus 2 by 3 now i'll replace this x raised to minus 2 by 3 in terms of y here okay so you observe this here uh, x raised to 1 by 3 is equal to y i'll square both sides so x raised to 2 by 3 equal to y square. I need minus 2 by 3. So I just reciprocate both sides. 1 by x raised to 2 by 3 is equal to 1 by y square. That means x raised to minus 2 by 3 is equal to y raised to minus 2. That will replace here. Okay. So I'll, I'll write dy upon dx is equal to 1 by 3 y raised to minus 2. Now dx will come this side. So dy will be equal to uh, this is dx right so dx upon 3y is square okay now this is a, this is a really important result okay because this dy here is my decimal part which i'm talking about in every question because integral part i'm pretty sure right if i say root sub something like root uh, cube root of 50 so you know that it is 3 point something right because it is between 3 and 4 but that decimal part becomes very very important actually so that's what i need to see here this value will take care of my decimal part okay this value will take care of my decimal part here okay that y differentiate to dy that dy is that decimal part that is dx by 3 y square i'll show you how okay now let's observe this i want to cal i let's say i want to calculate the first uh, this first one here I want to calculate what is the cube root of 71 okay now how I'll calculate this understand here so if I want to calculate cube root of 71 so now basically I know that I know I know that it is between 4 cube and 5 cube okay so obviously its answer is 4 point something so 4 plus some decimal part right because 4 cube is 64 it is more than 64 so 4 point something so this decimal part i'm actually worried about now okay so now here the nearest perfect cube which you are taking this is 4 this is the value of your y here so y will be actually equal to 4 okay now what is dx here dx is that difference from that that perfect cube okay so 71 is that uh, actual number at the, the perfect nearest perfect cube is 64 so 71 to 64 that difference is 7 this is actually my dx okay so now i'll write here my decimal part is dx upon 3y is square okay what is dx here dx is 7 what is 3y is square 3 into 4 is square that is equal to 7 by 48 what is 7 by 48 here it can be almost cancelled to 1 by 7 what is 1, 1 by 7 it's roughly 0 0.14 i can say 0 0.14 correct so that means my decimal part will be you know, 0.14. So what is my answer guys? So cube root of 71 is equal to 4.14. That's the answer. Okay. This is the funda of calculating cube root. So very, very easy and simple, right? What do you need to do here? Cube root 71. Just take that nearest perfect cube. Okay. Don't think about plus and minus. We'll subtract in the other case, right? I'll show you how just take the nearest perfect cube that is 4 is 4 uh, cube is 64 this is the 4 is the value of your y here in this formula okay dx is 7 okay dx is what dx is 7 that difference from the perfect cube 71 is the number if difference from the nearest perfect cube is actually 7 that is 64 ah so my decimal this is my decimal what is that this is my decimal part here so decimal part will be equal to dx by 3y square that's it 
ओके नाउ आई शो यू अंडरस्टैंड दिस जस्ट जस्ट रिमेंबर दिस फार्मूला dx by 3y square is the decimal cube that's it how much dx by 3y square okay now i'll show you in the other question see for example if i want to calculate the cube root of let's say 201 okay now if i want to calculate the cube root of 201 here so understand what is the nearest perfect cube here so now i know that it is it is between 5 cube 125 and 6 cube 216 right so the nearest perfect cube is 216 right so i'll take here 6 i'll take here 6 and obviously now 6 decimal part will is left out right now obviously the decimal part will be subtracted now because it is in between 5 and 6 so my final answer should be 5 point something so my final answer should be 5 point something right because it is between 5 and 6 no 5 cube is 125 ये फाइव और सिक्स के बीच में है राइट सो फाइव क्यू इज वन ट्वेंटी फाइव एंड सिक्स क्यू इज टू वन सिक्स तो फाइव पॉइंट समथिंग वन आंसर होगा ठीक है बट मेरे को यहाँ पे सिक्स लेना है क्योंकि एज पर ये जो रूल रूल पढ़ रहे हैं ना इसमें हमें नियरेस्ट प्रॉफिट क्यों लेना पड़ता है ठीक है और यही सिक्स वाई की वैल्यू बन जाती है तो हम क्या बोलेंगे वाई की वैल्यू सिक्स हो गया वो सिक्स हो गया राइट ऑल्सो नोट इज डी एक्स ईयर तो डी एक्स इज दैट डिफरेंस ना तो आपका नियरेस्ट प्रॉफिट क्यों क्या टू वन सिक्स से टू जीरो वन का डिफरेंस कितना हो गया फिफ्टीन हो गया दैट इज डी एक्स ईयर फिफ्टीन रिमेबर दैट फॉर्मूला What is the decimal part? dx by 3y is square. What is dx by 3y is square? So dx kitta ho gaya apka dx is how much? dx is 15 upon 3y is square. 3 into 6 ka square. Okay. So now you can easily cancel it. So our apka ban jayega ye 5 by 36, right? Now this is almost 1 by 7. Ah, uh, so almost 1 by 7. I can say roughly 0.14 again. So 6 minus 0.14. My answer will be. 5.86. That's the answer. So cube root of 201 is 5.86. That's simple, right? Subtract के चीज़ subtract करना है, add ये किसमें add करना है? But decimal part निकालने का एक ही तरीका है. Dx by 3y square. ये बस आपको यही याद रखना है, right? Let's take one more example here. Suppose मैंने यहाँ पे एक और example लिया. मेरे को calculate करना है cube root of 368. ठीक है? Now अभी ये 368 क्या है तो आपको पता है कि इसका नियरेस्ट क्यूब रूट क्या होगा सो यू नो दैट सेवन क्यूब इज इक्वल टू थ्री फोर्टी थ्री हाँ एंड एट क्यूब इज फाइव वन टू सो नियरेस्ट क्यूब रूट इज सेवन नो सेवन राइट दैट मीन्स इट इज एक्चुअली सेवन एंड वट इज द फाइनल आंसर सेवन पॉइंट समथिंग बिकॉज इट इज इन बिटवीन सेवन एंड एट एंड नियरेस्ट सेवन ही है आपका दैट मीन्स आपको सेवन में डिसमल पार्ट एड करना पड़ेगा यू नीड टू एड दैट डिसमल पार्ट इन सेवन सेवन प्लस दैट डिसमल पार्ट वट इज द डिसमल पार्ट गई इट इज ऑलवेज डी एक्स बाई थ्री वाई स्क्वायर ओके व्हाट इज डी एक्स ईयर तो 343 से 368 का डिफरेंस कितना है करेक्ट राइट तो 343 फोर्टी थ्री इज अस्ट प्रॉफिट क्यू थ्री का डिफरेंस इज 25 तो आप यहां पे लिखोगे 25 फाइव डी एक्स इज ट्वेंटी फाइव अपॉन थ्री वाई स्क्वायर इज थ्री वाई स्क्वायर तो वाई आपका ये सेवन हो गया ना सेवन इज वाई सो वाई इज इक्वल टू सेवन सो डी एक्स इज ट्वेंटी फाइव एंड वाई इज इक्वल टू सेवन ये आपका वाई है ना थ्री इन टू दिस इज सेवन का स्क्वायर ना फाइन सो ये तुम्हारा आपका आ गया ट्वेंटी फाइव बाई वन फोर्टी सेवन हाँ इट इज एक्चुअली वन बाई सिक्स रफली वन बाई सिक्स है ना सो आई कैन से रफली अराउंड वन पॉइंट सिक्स पॉइंट वन सिक्स तो आपका क्या हो गया सेवन प्लस पॉइंट वन सिक्स वोट इज माई फाइनल आंसर गाइज माई फाइनल आंसर इज सेवन पॉइंट वन सिक्स ओके दैट इज अ क्यू रूट ऑफ थ्री सिक्सटी एट द वेरी इजी राइट सो ट्रैक के कैसे ट्रैक एड के केस में एड ओके नाउ लेट सी इट्स यूज इन एन एक्चुअल एप्टीट्यूड क्वेश्चन ओके अच्छा सा क्वेश्चन देखते हैं जहां पर आप इसको डायरेक्टली यूज कर सकते हो ओके फाइन या सो लुक एट दिस क्वेश्चन गाइज दिस क्वेश्चन सेज दैट एन अमाउंट एट कंपाउंड इंटरेस्ट बिकम्स वन पॉइंट सिक्स टू टाइम्स इन थ्री ईयर्स फाइन द रेट ऑफ सी आर इट इज कंपाउंड इंटरेस्ट ओके सो दिस दिस इज द क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम कंपाउंड एंड सिंपल इंटरेस्ट चैप्टर दैट इज कम स्पेसिफिकली कंपाउंड इंटरेस्ट का क्वेश्चन है ये Uh, तो आपको यहाँ पे निकालना पड़ेगा रेट ऑफ इंटरेस्ट यू वॉन्ट टू कैलकुलेट हेयर फाइन सो वी ऑल नो द फॉर्मूला ऑफ कंपाउंड इंटरेस्ट वट इज द फॉर्मूला हेयर ए इज इक्वल टू पी इन टू वन प्लस आर बाई हंड्रेड रेस टू टी यही होता है है ना सो नाउ लेट मी लेट से द अमाउंट इज पी हेयर सो प्रिंसिपल इज पी हेयर सो अमाउंट हैज बिकम वन पॉइंट सिक्स टू टाइम्स तो मैं क्या लिखूंगा अमाउंट इज वन पॉइंट सिक्स टू पी दैट इज इक्वल टू वन प्लस आर बाई हंड्रेड रेज टू थ्री करेक्ट बिकॉज टी इज थ्री ईयर्स पी पी गेट्स कैंसिल आप यहाँ लिखोगे वन प्लस आर बाई हंड्रेड क्यू इज इक्वल टू 
1.62 so 1.62 becomes 162 by 100 now up up is a cube root karna hai right to niche 100 hai to 100 ka cube root decimal mein aa jayega to kya karo ek aur yahan pe zero add kar do hai na multiply by 10 divide by 10 kar do to usse kya hoga aapka ban jayega 1620 by 1000 hai na now 1000 ke root 10 hota hai to easy ho gaya na so now 1 plus r by 100 is equal is equal to this whole cube root right 1620 by 1000 ka cube root it becomes what niche 10 now here its cube root of 1620 this question boils down to calculating the value of 1620 right ka cube root so again now i want to calculate let's calculate the cube root of 1620 dekho what is cube root of 1620 guys so what is the nearest uh, cube here nearest kya hai yahan pe dekho that nearest cube perfect cube is i know that 11 cube is 1331 hai na 12 cube is 1728 so ye 12 ke nearest hai so aap yahan likhoge 12 but obviously I know that what is my answer my answer will be 11 point what is my answer my answer will be 11 point something now so this should be equal to actually 11 point something but nearest cube root 12 is our rule ke according to our rule so what do you do in that you have to subtract karna padega. so now decimal part will be subtracted from here 12 se, so we 11 point something aega, na? so decimal part we need to subtract here now what will, what will we be doing here how, how to calculate the decimal part only one way that is dx upon 3y square Okay, remember this formula dx by 3y square. What is dx now? So, deviation of 1620 from the nearest perfect cube that is 108. So, dx is 108. What is 3y square? Now, what is y here? This 12, hai na? so y is equal to 12. So, dx is 108 and y is equal to 12. So, 3 into 12 is square. Now, this easily gets cancelled actually. Okay, this will get cancelled 36 by 144. Aa 36 by 144 will be equal to 1 by 4. That means your decimal part is 0.25. So 12 minus 0.25. Therefore, you can calculate here cube root of 1620 is equal to 12 minus 0.25, 11.75. Okay. That means this is actually equal to 11.75 by 10 is equal to 1.175. So 1 plus r by 100 is equal to 1.175. So r by 100 is equal to 0 0.175 and r is equal to 17.5 percent. So multiply it becomes 17.5% per annum. That's the answer for this beautiful question. Not beautiful question, we have solved it in a beautiful way. Okay, so that's how you solve this kind of question so a very good technique guys so use it uh, you can use this in multiple topics like uh bar bar pe formula aata hai, iteration mein, jab mixtures ka use karte ho aap hai na, mixtures mein, replacements mein, SICI mein. okay so anywhere it can be used so very very useful technique for calculating q root of any number okay so i hope you enjoyed it you liked it thank you for watching yeah hi guys so here is the Unacademy Champions League for CAT 2022. Again, it is back for CAT 2022 uh, after CAT 2021. So it was very successful in CAT 2021. Lot of my students gave, the, uh, gave this one scholarships. They won MacBook Air, iPhone and Apple AirPods. Okay, so some great prizes here. Apart from that, uh, it's actually is very important to, important to give these tests uh, at this point of time to test your skills, to know that you are moving in the right direction or not. Okay. So some tricky questions will be involved in this test to test your understanding for the topics and you need to evaluate yourself. So this is on 24th of April at 12.30 p.m. And before that, we have some four days workshop for it to brush up your concepts. Uh, you can brush up your concepts through these workshops uh, in Quant, LID and Verbal. So all the, the relevant enrollment link I'll put in description. You can just click uh, the links in the description. Okay. So uh, this, is, this is a must gift test for everyone. So do give this test guys and see the analysis and work on that. Okay. Thank you.